Hello, my name is Ben, and welcome to Year 6 Science. Did you know all computer information is just a bunch of ones and zeros? Today we'll find out what binary numbers are and why our computer needs them. Computers cannot count, not the way that we do anyway. Computers can help us communicate, listen to music, create projects and surf the web, but they don't count how we do. Let's look at our hands. We know we have 10 fingers and this is why we count in what is called base 10. We can count to 10 using our fingers then continue, we either have to take our shoes off or start again. We need a way to record the 10 we already got to. The base 10 way of counting tells us how many times we have started again. For example, the number 10 has a 1 on the left telling us we have got to 10 once. The number 11 tells us we have got to 10 once and have counted another finger. So the number 11 means 1 10 and 1 1. The number 23 means 2 10s and 1 lot of 3. The numbers can keep going as we add another number to the left, letting us know we have got to 100, then another for 1000, and so on. Our way of counting is really clever. We use just 10 numbers to count any number. A written number is a code for adding up. The thing with computers is that although they appear elaborate, they're actually quite simple. Basically, they are made up of billions of switches that can either be turned on or off. They can only recognise these two states, on, off, yes, no. They can only understand two digits, one and zero. So computers need a binary code, otherwise known as base two. It works the same as base 10, but instead it tells us when we reach the number two by using the number on the left. So in binary code, a 0 is a 0 and a 1 in it is a 1, but a 2 is a 1 and a 0. It looks like a 10, but it's not, it's a 2. And when we get to 3, it's a 1 and a 1. So in base 10, the number on the left tells us when we reach 10 units, 10 tens, 10 hundreds and 10 thousands. In base 2, the number on the left tells us when we reach 2 units, 2 twos, 2 fours and so on. This allows binary numbers to grow really quickly. For example, the number 16 looks like 10,000. Computers can process billions of bits of information easily, as all they have to do is recognise one thing. Is the switch on or off? And finally, a joke. Did you know there are only 10 types of people in the world? Those that understand binary and those that don't.